is up welcome to another vlog you guys good morning actually it's afternoon for me and many of you guys have been asking for me to do some cleaning videos so I figure I clean every single day I will take you guys with me but today I have a project to do and I am cleaning out our da 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 refrigerator so you guys I am gonna show you right now what it looks like on the inside I figure like it is best to clean out your fridge like just before you go grocery shopping that way everything is that's in there is like new clean organized and ready to go um, so right now we're like in that transition where we need to go grocery shopping but I need to clean out my fridge first get rid of a bunch of stuff in there and just kind of empty it all out get it all clean scrub down and um, just ready to go for new groceries which means a grocery haul for you guys coming up here pretty soon. Are you guys ready to see the dreaded refrigerator? All right, do 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 do. You guys, this is a magnet that our friends and I like. It's a, it's an ongoing joke. We try to stick these on each other's cars when we see each other on the back of the car without the other one knowing. It's been on our fridge for a little bit. I keep meaning to take it over and put it on their car, and I keep forgetting. But anyways, okay. Let's open up this fridge and see what it looks like. So we've got quite a few things to go through in here that like might just be expired or that I just need to organize our home chef meal right there, you guys, that we absolutely love. I actually need to make that soon. We got all this and then as you can see like in the bottom, like where all the crumbs drop, I need to scrub all of that out, get all of that cleaned up, throw away some produce that may not be so good. And then honestly, this side, you guys, I've got to go through literally all of this stuff because it's the stuff that we use, but not like always on a regular basis. So I want to go through and see what I need to get rid of. We've had hot sauces that have been down here forever, like forever. So I've got to go through those, see which ones we need to keep of those. Benny's licking the fridge to kind of help, I guess, help uh, clean it. <laughs> oh my, Benny, yuck. Don't do that. That's so gross. Are you trying to help me? Are you trying to help me clean? That's so nice. That's so nice. You say hi to everybody. Say hello, everybody. Oh, here comes Jasper. Jealous, jealous. Okay, so you guys, I'm gonna start working on this. I'm gonna start pulling everything out, getting everything scrubbed down. It's kind of nice because these drawers and stuff, they will come completely out and I can scrub them down and get all of that ready to go. So here we go, you guys. This is my project for the day. So I wanna know you guys though, how often do you guys clean out your fridge? I think I've asked you guys this before when I did my other fridge clean out. Um, I would say like a deep full scrub down of my fridge, I probably try to do like once every two months or so. But that's only because usually when we like I'm always doing like somewhat of a cleanup in there. So if we're getting new groceries or something, I'll try to wipe down the things. But like to full on take every single thing out and scrub it down and make it clean, I probably, I'm gonna guess once every month or two months, just depending on time and just really exactly how dirty it is. So I'm curious how often you guys do it. Let me know, be honest. Uh, but let me know down below how often it is for you guys and also oh I was gonna tell you guys I actually just got this stuff in the mail that I want to show you guys real quick because I think it's actually very awesome So I just got this in the mail from a company called teamy, which is so awesome We got this cute little tumbler here. That is so cute. It's pink I'll take it out so you guys can see it and then there's also this 30-day detox um that they have that they sent, which I thought was really awesome too. You guys can go check out their website and see all their different like tea products that they have and different things, but there's their website right there actually. How convenient, you guys, go check it out. And then this is actually what I'm so excited about. I absolutely love this. It's a detox mask, green tea blend, and it's got like lemongrass, it's like clay-like. So I'm gonna show you guys this I wanna show you guys kind of what it looks like and how it works um, when we put it on. So Ashlyn and I have already talked about doing this tonight together. So we're actually gonna do that with you guys and kind of show you guys what it looks like, let you know how it feels, all of that fun stuff. So you guys love, love, love this stuff. And so many of you guys have literally asked me like, what is my nighttime skin routine? I don't do a lot of things on my skin, but I do love 
good detox masks, you guys. So, Timmy is like amazing. So, I will show you guys tonight what this looks like, let you know what it smells like, all that fun stuff, and you guys would absolutely love this. So, go check out their website. It's teamyblends.com. Teamy I'll put it all in the description down below so that you guys can go check out all the different products they have. The seriously amazing things and um, stay tuned for tonight because we're gonna do this detox mask. All right, first things first, you guys, I'm gonna just start pulling everything out and then I will probably just make piles, like I'll throw away the stuff that needs to be thrown away and then I'll just do like the different like things together. So like cheeses, um, you know, all the jarred stuff and we'll get it all ready to go. Um, let me know though when you guys clean or like how you organize your fridge I know a lot of people have like different bins and things that they put things in to like organize it I don't really do that because I feel like our fridge is just not big enough for it I guess but maybe it would help with the with the space. I don't know so um, Let me know what you guys do. I'm always open to new ideas and then also I promise I'll get to it you guys maybe I'll I'm like, maybe if I keep talking, I don't have to actually do it. <laughs> no, but I actually was going to ask you guys for your ideas um, for a pantry to organize my pantry because I need to actually really go through my pantry too since we're going grocery shopping because it's just kind of an array of different like crazy things. So if you guys know any tips, tricks, ideas for like even the pantry clean out, let me know and I will try to incorporate some of your guys' ideas into our pantry organization um, video that we're gonna do coming up. So let me know, our pantry is not huge. In fact, do you guys wanna see our pantry? Maybe you guys can give me some ideas of some pantry organization I, we can do with like my size of pantry. You guys, I'm warning you though, it's looking kinda crazy, but oh well. It's summer, no shame in my game. Here you go, you guys. This is our pantry right now. And it's just an array of like, the kids get in here, the snacks get thrown, like I'm telling you guys, empty. Empty, right? So, um, I've just gotta go through it. I do have these bins that I put stuff, look at this you guys, empty. Are you kidding me? Okay, so I, ha I do put like granola bars and different things in here, and usually I'll just like empty out the granola bars in here and then throw the boxes away. And then, like even these, like I try to get rid of as much like box stuff. I just have not, I've been so busy, you guys. I haven't even had a chance to like empty things into here. But anyways, give me your ideas. It's not a very big pantry. I do have cereal containers and stuff up there. But I do also want to move some of my ingredient, like flour and stuff from this cupboard because it's getting pretty full and put it in here. So if you guys have any ideas on con different containers, I know Costco's having a pretty good deal on some containers. I don't know if I wanna spend 60 bucks on it though. So anyways, that was kind of a tangent away from the fridge, but any ideas you guys let me know because that's gonna be my next project, getting that all finished up and ready for like when it's gonna be back to school soon. So I wanna get like the snacks and everything completely organized so that um, we have that all ready to go before school starts. So any ideas, let me know. I know you guys like like love stuff from the dollar store or Walmart, any bins, things like that. Leave it down in the comments below. I would appreciate it. Let's get started on this fridge, guys. All right, guys, a quick little tip or just I guess like uh, update. We were not a fan of these from Costco. Let me see if I can focus this. These are from Costco. They're like the chicken salad, cranberry almond chicken salad with white meat chicken. Not a fan. No one likes these. So we are probably going to, let me see if they're expired. They're expired. So we're gonna throw those out. down here you want, you want to see vulnerability check that out all those yummy crumbs and nastiness in there so I got to scrub all these down which actually always feels so good once it's all done but yep 
got to wash all of these, this, 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 all this, and then check this out. Boom shakalaka, baby. Look at that. So these all come out, which is nice because I can just go through and wash each one individually and then wipe it all down and get the food quickly back in. I already actually threw away a few things that have been expired. So basically what I'll do is go through all of these, especially these ones. Sorry, my kids had mac and cheese. Um, especially these ones just to see like what's expired. I think sometimes we forget like ketchup, relish, all that stuff goes bad. I actually just threw away two things of relish that we had that we bought from I think Costco and they were totally expired. We don't use them very often so I almost forgot that they were in there. So yeah, a lot of the time with the fridge and the good thing about cleaning it all out and get it out, sometimes you forget what's in there and all this stuff that you don't normally use and then you're like, oh crap, it's, it's like totally expired. So um, it's good to do this more often than not just so you kind of know what's in there and what's about to expire so you can use it up and all of that. So anyways, I'm going to get to scrubbing all these things down and then I'm going to put this stuff all back into the fridge, all nice and clean and organized. Oh, I love the feeling. It's a lot of work. It's actually not that much work if you don't have a ton of food to like go through. And I feel like because we're in between shopping trips, I'm not dealing with like a lot of different foods and stuff. So it's easier to organize because there's more room for it. So, all right, going through all this stuff. Here we go, guys. wiped out washed out not they're not even sticky anymore at all so now I need to go through and actually just get all of these things scrubbed down let me show you I've got to go through and scrub all of this stuff all the way down there and yeah so that is what I'm working on next and then I'll be able to put all the drawers back in and get the food back in here ready to go now to put the food back in I've already gone through some of this I've got to probably go through a few more things just to make sure they're not like expired and then we're gonna rearrange this fridge All right, you guys, so I'm just going through here and starting to put all this stuff back in and it's fitting so much better because I had to throw so much stuff away. Just like some hot sauces and some relish and actually our ketchup was not good anymore so I threw that away. Um, but this is like the perfect opportunity too. Like I've had to like wipe off some of like the heads of different things like the jelly and so it's a perfect opportunity to go through and do that as well and just wipe down your containers and get those all nice and clean. And then also I noticed that some of them like on the bottom of them had like a little bit of stickiness so I would just go through and wipe off all the containers of like the sticky stuff. Yeah. Right and siding. And so yeah, so I've got basically this stuff left. This is all still good, not expired at all. So I'm gonna throw those into the fridge and then a few other things and I will show you guys the final product. All right, you guys, so I am all done with the fridge. It looks so nice, and I definitely need to go grocery shopping. So check it out, you guys. Here is the final product. Let's see it. Hallelujah, hallelujah, 
Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Boom, you guys. Looks so much better, feels so much better. Everything is literally wiped down. We've just got a few things in here. Obviously, we gotta go buy some more food, produce for sure, and all of the things. We got our butter, and then all of our stuff that's not expired. It's all good, ready to go, ready to be eaten. And you guys, it feels so nice to have everything done and in here. And yeah, we just have to reorganize as soon as we go grocery shopping, but it feels so good. So that's all of it, you guys. Um, I'm gonna actually, we'll get Danny's reaction here in just a second. Um, he's upstairs doing an Instagram live while I'm cleaning this out. So as soon as he comes down here, we'll get his reaction to the fridge because you know, he's gonna be like, whoa, that looks way good. Um, but I wanted to show you guys, I told you I had to unpackage this. The Timmy Tumblr, look how stinking cute that is, you guys. So you guys, as soon as after we get Danny's reaction to the refrigerator, um, Ashlyn and I are gonna do this this evening and you guys will get to see how it works what and all of that stuff. So stay tuned for that. We're still gonna put that on and let's get Danny's reaction. All right, we got Danny here, smiling more. Uh, just a more. Just yeah, a more. just a little more. Uh, so you want to see the refrigerator? Yes, oh, and I got my, my Thin Wheats. Not Wheat Thins, Thin Wheats. Oh yeah. It's the generic brand over there. And they're actually pretty good. I've been eating them. Tastes the same. Yeah, they're pretty similar. Yeah. Okay, come look at the fridge. Ooh, open, I want me to open it up myself? Oh, you want me to open it I, for I you? Not, Are you not I'm, able to open it I'm up not, for I'm yourself? Because I'm not like color coordinated, so that's kind of hiding back there. Color coordinated? Look, I'm wearing like multicolor, like multi pack. Oh goodness. Since I'm, when did you care about that? I'm in edit mode. Yeah, you're edit crazy. What's that? Okay, open it up. Caution. Oh no. Oh no. Da da da. Whoa. 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 What? We need to go grocery shop. <laughs> that's what I said. <laughs> Time for groceries. But that's what you want. Yep. You want to have it cleared out because there's times we go grocery shopping. Sorry, I have food in my mouth. There's times we go grocery shopping and we're like. On the way home. Hey Ash, can you help kind of clear out the fridge a little bit or make room? And yep. it's already done. It's already done. Don't That's have to so wipe awesome. it out, anything. It's all ready to go, ready for groceries to go inside. And yeah, it feels good. No. And I even went through and wiped down all of like the tops of stickiness and all that stuff. And we had a bunch of expired stuff in there, so That's sweet. it's now in the trash. Yeah, so that's good. Now we know exactly what we need to fill in. Yep. I'm just looking right here. I'm like, okay, lunch meat. I'm like, you know what I mean? Yeah, like, all the you different know things. Regular, so. It's way easier to make a list when you've gone through everything. Yeah, so. something to drink. Yeah, that could. That might be good. Yeah, something Bill. to drink. I was saying produce like crazy. We're all out of produce. So but we even need to that, get that though, like it helps you like realize, okay, we've got some cheese. We've got, you know, we've got st like some of those things. Yeah, exactly. Because a lot of times we'll just go get them and then and then like we're like, okay, we have like way too much. Yep. So. Totally. So, this is my treat to myself tonight. Boom! Ooh. The detox mask. Ashlyn and I are going to do it. Show these guys how it's done. That's awesome. So, very cool. Good job, babe. Thanks, babe. Thanks. So, as promised, you guys, I told you guys I would show you this detox mask from Teamy. I actually really love this detox mask because you literally see results after the first time using it. Um, whereas other masks and stuff, I feel like you have to use it like quite a few times to tell if it's making a difference. And so I really love this. I'm going to show you guys how I put it on. It smells amazing. Like it just smells like fresh and clean and oh, I love it. So basically I'm just going to wet my face, kind of rinse off like the makeup and stuff that I have on. I have a little bit of makeup on. Also a little summer, if you guys can see from the other day. And I tend to like right here um, break out the most, like in this area. And my dermatologist said it's mainly hormonal because it's not always there, but um, you know, around that time of the month, I tend to like get like hormonal breakouts. So this is kind of like my problem area right here. Um, so I'm gonna just rinse my face real quick and just totally go. Totally, oh man, guys. 
But I love this mask because I just totally feel completely rejuvenated. My skin feels rejuvenated, refreshed every time I use it. I absolutely love it. Okay, so I wet my face down, kind of got, you know, I mean, you can see these problem areas, but whatever you guys we're gonna put this mask on and let it work it's magic so basically you're gonna just take it it's kind of like this hunter green color and you're gonna put it all over your face masks are so fun I was gonna do this with Ashlyn but she um, has a friend over so I'm like you know what I'm tired I'm gonna get ready to go to bed soon and so I'm gonna just do it by myself tonight so we do we like to do it a lot together but oh my gosh you guys <laughs> do i look like a hunter or what oh my goodness can't believe i'm doing this in front of you guys but you know what we all have problem areas right we all have issues that we might not like about our skin sometimes it's hard to have like a full i don't know about you guys like by the end of the night i just don't have like a quick easy nighttime routine for my skin to kind of like help take care of it so this is kind of just like a quick easy way to detox your skin and just get it like nice and rejuvenated so that is another reason why i love this so i just put this on and then it's you let it dry for about 10 to 15 minutes and you can actually take it down to your neck which i'm going to do too because honestly this just feels so nice like a cooling refreshing sensation right now that I feel and I love it so do I look scary Boo! <laughs> you guys Danny's sleeping right now maybe I should go like try to scare him with this mask see if it will creep him out although he is kind of used to seeing me this way so it might be kind of normal to him so there you go guys oh it feels so good you guys like that nice cool refreshing sensation Ooh, feels so good i love it okay i can feel it detoxing so i'm gonna leave this on 10 15 minutes and then i will jump back on here when it's all like dried and ready to be rinsed off so booyah booyah <laughs> all right you guys so this is getting pretty dried out oh my gosh i can barely talk so and it's like for all skin types especially dry and sensitive skin so if you have sensitive or dry skin this is great for you um but you guys i think it's time it's been about 10 minutes it's actually been about 12 minutes so i'm going to rinse this off and oh, i look crazy so ashlyn's like uh did you audition for are you auditioning for wicked <laughs> I'm like, yes, yes I am. So I'm gonna rinse this off and then I'm gonna just kind of show you guys the results of what it looks like after. All right, you guys, so just dry in my face. Oh, you still feel like that cooling sensation, which is so nice. It just makes your skin feel so fresh and I absolutely love it. So, oh, I got my shirt wet too. So you guys, so it is like literally my skin feels so silky soft. I absolutely love this mask. And the great thing is you can use it two to three times a week if you want. So um, I highly recommend it, you guys. This is what it looks like. The Teamy Detox Mask Green Tea Blend. There you go. There it is, you guys. I'm going to leave all the info down in the description box down below if you guys want to try this out. They also have many other products, beauty products, teas, um, detox drink teas, different things like that. So go check out the link down below and, and go order you guys some, especially this stuff, you guys. It is gold. I absolutely love it. So that is it from us tonight you guys thank you guys so much for watching hope you guys enjoyed the the fridge clean out and we will have a pantry clean out coming out very very soon so stay tuned for that you guys thank you for all of your love all of your support all that you guys do to uplift and support our family we are so very grateful and don't forget to choose your day i see a light in your eyes i fall Oh, I love my shirts. Thank you. I love your store. Can I come again? Yeah, come back whenever you want. Okay. Bye. Bye. Have a great day. Okay, but tell, tell someone if you, if someone wants to come to my, to my store. Okay, I'll tell all my family. Okay. 
Okay. Bye-bye.